Hi, I'm Matthew Ashley and welcome to Blackwell Global's Daily Market Update. Starting with the cable and the PM move fractionally higher as the NYSE GDP figure came in on target at 0.6%. The result offset the better US employment data including the slip in the unemployment rate to 4.7% and this saw the pair closing up at around the 1 spot 2163 handle. Looking forward we have the US PPI data due out shortly which could be worth keeping an eye on. Turn to the euro now and unlike the cable, the pair had no trouble surging higher to close at around the 1 spot 0670 handle. Buying pressure stemmed largely from a stronger German trade balance of 18.5 billion and an uptick in the German wholesale price index of 0.5% month on month. As for the session to come, a number of ECB officials are making announcements which could carry the euro's momentum forward into the new week. Finally, the Aussie dollar also had a rather bullish session, rallying in response to the stronger Australian data. Specifically, the home loans figure jumped up by 0.5%, which was in stark contrast to the forecast, which had been predicted to show a 1% contraction. As a result, the PM moved up to the 0 spot 75.34 mark by the end of the session to challenge the 100-day EMA. Looking ahead, monitor the NAB business confidence figures closely. Well, that's all I have for you today. So, Matthew Ashley, Blackwell Global's daily market update.